not really. I think that's just you. But then again, you have all this. Just say a break. What's going on with you? Why do you keep asking me that? You've been asking me that all day long. What's wrong with you? What's wrong with you? I'm just, I'm tired. You're going to be a mother. I am a mother. I have you, I have your sister. I know when something is going on with you. So, you know you can talk to me and I'm listening. If I'm being honest, I just feel so low of a person. Every single day I wake up and I just feel like dirt, like I'm nothing. You know, Anthony came over my house the other day and I could just tell by the look in his eyes. He feels like my body belongs to him. That's my best friend's husband. Why did I even sleep with him? Like why? I just feel disgusting. And you know, I'm, I'm not ashamed of my baby, but I just know when I see my son, it's just gonna be a reminder of all the mistakes that I've made. Baby, first of all, there is no but. And you're not trash, you're not garbage, and you should not be feeling low. Let me tell you something. If you knew half of the stuff that people are really dealing with, you wouldn't be feeling like anything. You really don't have time for that. You've gotta look to the future. You have to look to the future. You can't change the past. I know I can't, Mom, but my friend Amber, she never deserves something like this. And this is a permanent decision. This is not like a temporary mistake, something that's gonna go away. When the child is born, it's just a constant reminder of what we did. How am I gonna live with myself like that? Well, the truth is everything that's done in the dark is gonna come to the light. I've told you that since you were little, right? So we can't change the past. It's gonna come out at some point. But this is not the time to fall into depression and feeling bad about yourself. Because I'm telling you something, if you knew what the neighbors were into, Neha, you would not have these feelings. You have to come to terms with what it is. I need my grandson to be healthy and to be happy, okay? Anthony is just gonna have to pay. That's just what it is. And every time you start feeling low, go shopping. Little retail therapy, you know what I'm saying? Baby, listen. You're gonna get through this. You're not gonna be worried about what other people think because you can't change what they think. You have a little bundle of joy. My grandbaby. We're gonna go shopping and we're gonna feel better. We're gonna get ice cream. And you're not gonna worry about what could be? What's gonna happen with Amber? We don't know. People think, on your life for a reason or a season. I think it's just a lot more than what shopping can fix, Mom. But you know what? I appreciate having you, somebody else I can talk to. I'm always here for you. And you don't have to worry because I'm always gonna keep your secrets. I'm always gonna have your back. And Anthony really don't want no smoke. <laughs> In fact, you can't be serious. Oh, I'm very, very, very serious, honey. Because let me tell you something. I could use one of those nice blue Porsches. That would oh be lovely. I think God. a nice sky blue. Mom, are you serious yeah, right now? I'll get the matching.